guys, hey, what's up? This is your fan Captain Diaz. I'm back with another weekly tech updates, and this is a part of this episode 74 of the WWE. We got some big news coming out from this complete week. We got some upcoming application updates. We rarely got this type of news in this WWE, but we got that in this video too. So without any further ado, let's go get started. I talked about uh, start or you can say a bit of second ago that uh, um, application news is there and that application is basically the metas meta is working on a kind of say a twitter like of alternative a screenshot has been leaked out and it is a kind of you know uh, more likely to be a chatbot type of twitter based interview stuff and also they are adding ai based analytics on that and the instagram and other applications too so Let's see how it does. However, Twitter is having a lot of ups and downs coming out from this couple of months and um, couple of time too. And also, they are working. Basically, the Meta's Oculus brand is working on their flagship VR headset, which will be focusing and giving a around five thousand dollars of big price point is expected for this guy. Let's see how it does. Talking about the Vivo's uh, sub brand, uh, Vivo IQ. Basically, IQ Sam Pro is finally launching. And this is the IQ Neo Sand Pro, and it will be launching by the July 4. As of that flagship, and the Vivo is a flagship basically, the Vivo X90s and the IQ 11 as a screenshot. Or you can see the photo images has been leaked out, and they are looking really good. However, following that same type of design look for the both the guys, as if they are coming under the 90 series, and the IQ is coming under the 11 series. So not big vibrant changes there into the design, completely same. And a lot of uh, things are that to talk about IQ. Um, basically, not IQ, the Vivo. Vivo has left Germany officially. As of their website has completely wiped off. Still, the support is there for your devices. And uh, the software upgrade, as I promised, uh, will be there for your devices. Vital. Um, we rarely talk about this brand. Uh, this is a kind of a C Transitions Mobile, one of the sub brand. Just like the Infinix and the Techno, this is uh, one another brand. Vital. S23 is coming. And this is a. Giving a lot of things at a price point of under 8000 INR. As if it is having a water of notch display, like 15 episode main sensor is there, a good looking back design is there, which is also color changing, and a lot of things are there. Unisoft T606 processor, it is coming by the June of 14, so yeah, it is giving a lot of things. Plus, Nord 3, and a lot of uh, leaks and stuff, and the images, and finally, the launch is near really, really soon. It will be launching in India really soon. However, um, this guy will be having a Dimensity 9000 processor and the Android 13 out of the box. We talk about the Oppo Find entry and finally some of the things are kind of coming into the hands. Uh, this guy will be having a wireless charging and also the flagship tire camera of the Oppo. And following a lot of new customization on their operating system and a lot of backend support from the Oppo itself. Samsung, Samsung Galaxy S23 FE is uh, finally coming under the hood. This guy is uh, really coming really soon in the Q3 2023. 4500mAh battery will be there, 25 watt of wireless, 25 watt of wired charging will be supported for this guy. And it will be following that same flagship design and uh, kind of a see a lot of good impressions is expected for this guy. It will be launching in selected regions that, that might be a turning point for this guy because it is known for a lot of value for money features on the S series based devices. Samsung Galaxy Z5 series or you can say Z5 and the Z45 will be having its own separate event apart from the other devices which was you know uh, trying to come under the hood with this devices but it is said that it will be having a complete a separate event in USA as of it is expected in August which is around a tier only couple of months is that. Samsung Galaxy Watch 6 series. It will be having a W930 processor, basically the Exynos processor, and having a lot of new stuff also on the top of it. Wear OS will be having a new custom stuff on the top of it too. Also, the tablet has been passed from the FCC certification, and soon it is under the hood on the BIA certification, and soon we will be able to see a lot of leaks coming out while from the Indian launch, and also apart from that, we will be able to get a lot. Well, this guy is expected to launch it before the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold or can say Z5 series. So let's see how it does. The Z Flip 5 has completely got certified in India and it will be having its own way of talking because this guy is expected to have a lot of things. 
a uh, lot of things are suggesting that a promo video which was seen around from a couple of weeks ago uh, is completely the same thing itself and uh, now it is time you know we might be able to see some of the leaks and stuff and uh, leaks and stuff from the brand itself in a way of uh, their marketing too and uh, their poster teaser might be appealing too also the one ui for this uh, foldable and flippable devices are going to be completely turning upon so let's see how this uh, flip and the floor because this guy is you know trying to convey us a lot as if we will be able to see a lot of competition from the tech noise that oneplus is there oppo is itself oneplus is coming basically and the google fold is there in selected regions so let's see how it does the budget device uh, can't be ignored the samsung galaxy m34 it was been leaked in on their web page completely and uh, it will be launching in india really soon however um this guy will be having the android 13 out of the box and it is expected that it will be under 20k with the water drop notch list so let's see how it does Infinix has unveiled two new devices Infinix 35G for Infinix Note 35G for India and it is under the 14k with a lot of good features on the top of it bypass charging which is the highlighting feature basically it will be charging when you, uh, you are playing the games and wanted to charge your phone it won't be charging the battery directly it will be giving the power to the motherboard as if it won't get heated really easily Infinix Note 30 VIP has also got unveiled. This guy is having a 60 watt, 68 watt of wire charging and also a really good efficiency of the wireless charging. Uh, kind of the, the Note 30 is focusing a lot into a wireless charging as of the Infinix. Xiaomi Pad 6 has got officially in India basically that tablet and it is uh, around 30k IANA, under 30k IANA. It is a really good and that bird has also got a great. That's not a big part because it was a really good and a lot of expectations were there for these devices. But a kind of a say Xiaomi might be going to leave India as of they are having a lot of problems with the fan of each marketing strategy in India. And in the past they have a lot of big ups and downs in Indian market. So might be you know trying to convince their uh, image into India or might be leaving the India completely. Let's see how it does. Google Pixel 8 and this guys are kind of say you know really their flagship based and this time we got a complete camera spec sheet of both the devices 8 and 8 Pro. Now, one of them is having the Samsung's uh, G1 sensor, uh, GN1 sensor and the Sony dynamic sensors are there and a new sensor has been seen around it is a thermometer sensor as of uh, a complete video was leaked, it will be able to detect out what um, your temperature of the body is. A kind of a nice feature. Let's see how the Google will be trying to convey that it is really good. Honor 90 Global Launch. Finally, it is heading towards the Paris launching and it is a really good smartphone. And it is expected as July 6th is the date and officially confirmed on the poster too. Uh, apart from this, Honor is also expected to launch uh, in India really back, uh, really really soon and however it is expected that the mother said which was uh, one of the CEOs of the key person of the realme and uh, has been departed and it is expected that he might be joining the Europeans, not the Europeans, um, Honor based line of smartphones so let's see how that will be coming to India. And nothing, nothing phone 2 is uh, finally heading towards the uh, launch really soon in the July 11 and it will be having the operating system nothing worse too and uh, a lot of new things are expected and a lot of new stuff is also expected on the top of the nothing worse one and uh, the nothing phone 1 will be also receiving and it is expected after the 3 phones the nothing phone 3 might be unveiling a uh, really soon in the future how the plan of the brand is there we might be able to see the how the nothing will be able to you know drop the feature updates on their devices uh, and as of um, nothing might be able to cut off the nothing phone one at that time so let's see how it does Apple um, Vision Pro headset basically um, a lot of things are there ups and downs a lot of updates needed for this guy a lot of things are there that Apple will be optimizing by the time in future but this Vision Pro headset is expected that a budget or you can say a cheaper version which will be named after the Apple Vision um, not the Pro basically uh, it will be coming very soon but it won't be under that $1,000 uh, $1, price point of the INA it will be more cheaper than that uh, it will be more expensive basically for Apple to make that device so let's see how it does and uh, if Apple is working we might be able to see a new stuff as of uh, Steve Jobs did with a lot of their devices 
first unveil a big price point and then uh, you know what I'm trying to say. Now those were some of the big updates going on from this completely week. We have a lot of disturbance coming on from this week. A lot of things are there going on from ups and downs. So I hope you are able to converse and understand and adjust basically. That's more important. Anyways, uh, if you appreciated the work, then press the bell icon and get your share ready for more amazing content. Like, share, subscribe. Gonna be appreciating. What do you think about the WQ74? Let us know in the comment section down below. That's basically the part of the disturbance. So we'll get you in the next video. This was Captain Diaz. You were watching Gareth and Diaz. Stay safe, stay connected. Peace out.